Aloha, and welcome to the Maui County Office on Aging 52nd Annual Outstanding Older Americans Award Ceremony. It's a pleasure to enjoy this celebration in this, the National Older Americans Month of May. We hope you enjoyed the opening slideshow that, commem that commemorates all of the past outstanding older Americans of Maui County. This year's theme is Communities of Strength. The very fact that each of us is participating today speaks to our strength. We've survived the most unique year of any of our lives. We know that Maui County is built on the strength of our people, and we have some extremely dedicated kapuna who contribute to our collective strength as a community each and every day. You will see as we introduce the nominees that we are truly blessed to have, to live among some very exceptional, strong, and resilient leaders. Although we will announce only one male and one female winner, the truth is that each and every volunteer you will meet today is truly exceptional. These individuals, out of almost 40,000 older Maui County residents, have been recognized for their selfless contributions and every nominee deserves to be celebrated today. Thanks to the members of the Council on Aging who volunteered for the very difficult task of choosing this year's winners. We are eager to begin all of the excitement and we are pleased to first welcome the Honorable Mayor Michael Victorino to address us. Mayor Victorino, thank you for joining us today. Also, Chair Alice Lee and Council Member Yuki Lee Sugimura, who have uh, also been a big part of everything we do for our elders here, our kupuna, as you mentioned. In everything we do and say, we honor them. They have honored us with a lot of years of experience, knowledge, and continue to help in our community during this really pandemic of uh, our, our lives that none of us could ever imagine. So thank you, Deborah, for addressing that, and welcome to all of you, to all the people of Maui County, especially our older citizens, our kupuna. I especially want to say mahalo. And I have a proclamation that Darlene and Gina will be reading and will uh, kind of cover a lot of the areas that we feel are important to you, our elders, our kupuna. Darlene, please. Thank you, Mayor. County of Maui Proclamation. Whereas the theme this year is Communities of Strength, which describes the overwhelming response to protect and assist our vulnerable population. And whereas the County of Maui includes approximately 42,500 seniors aged 60 and over who are nearly 25% of our population. And whereas the County of Maui benefits when people of all ages, abilities, and backgrounds are included and encouraged to share their successes and stories of resilience. And whereas the County of Maui recognizes our need to nurture ourselves, reinforce our strength, and continue to thrive in times of both joy and difficulty. And whereas the County of Maui shall foster our communities of strength by creating opportunities to share stories and learn from each other, as well as engaging older adults through education, recarnation, recreation, and service. Now, therefore, on behalf of our Mayor, Michael P. Victorino of the County of Maui, he hereby proclaims May 2021 as Older Americans Month 2021. Throughout the County of Maui, and he urges every resident to recognize our older population and the people who support them as essential contributors. And that's being presented to the Department of Office, on the Office of Aging, Deborah. This will go to your office, you know. But we, not, we cannot forget, if I may, we cannot forget not only you, Deborah, in the Office of Aging, we have the Kaunoa Senior Center and the Kaunoa Program. We have our MEO Elder Program. We have so many others to thank. 
And we want to also recognize Lori Suhaku, Director of the Department of Housing and Human Concern, and her deputy, Linda Manzel, who is also on. Thank you, ladies, for everything you do and continue to do in this county. And so for me, I'll close with this. Being a senior today, along with many of you on, the, and on, this, on this call or on this video, is really an honor and a pleasure. Our forefathers realized how much and how important taking care of our kupuna was. And they have done, a, we I think continue doing what they asked us to do is that legacy. And it's hopeful that it will continue for generations to come. Maui stands tall as a county on what we do for our kupuna each and every day, whether it's transportation, meals on wheels, housing, you name it, we've been there and we continue to work, work hard to do all of these programs. Whether it's Halimakua, Halimaolu, um, a family life center, uh, uh, you know, we could go on and on and we'll never end saying all the thank yous. And Deborah, I think I'll leave some of that to you later on. Mm -hmm. But really, to all the people of Maui County, especially our Kupuna, I honor you, I thank you, and I join you in today's <laughs> festivities. Mahalo. <sighs> Mahalo, Mayor Victorino and Darlene. Um, Mayor, you said it so well. We are truly blessed in Maui County from uh, every area, from our citizens all the way up to our federal, our, our state um, representatives, our county council. Um, we are a unique community with an incredible amount of support at every layer, and uh, it's, it truly is a blessing to, to be able to serve Kapuna, and we're lucky. I'm not sure if people realize how, how fortunate we are to have a community that is so invested and to have so many agencies invested in making life better. So thank you very much for your words today. You're welcome, um, best, of, best of luck in the program today. Mahalo. Go ahead. Thank you, sir. We're excited. It's going to be fun. <laughs> <laughs> um, the Office on Aging is a division of the county's Department of Housing and Human Concerns. And we are very privileged today. Mayor already thanked Director Lori Suhako and Deputy Director Linda Munsell. They're going to be here to offer words of welcome and congratulations. But I will say that every, each and every day, they remain fully supported to, to all of the citizens, the citizens of Maui County. And those of us who work with Kapuna really couldn't do our jobs as well without their continued support. So Lori and Linda, thank you. Thank you, Deb. Thank you. So, um, good morning, everyone, and welcome to the 57th, 52nd annual Outstanding Older Americans of Maui celebration. On behalf of the department, um, I'd like to say a special thanks to Deborah and her colleagues at the Maui County Office on Aging for putting together this acknowledgement and celebration of this year's nominees for Outstanding Older Americans in Maui County. You know, this event feels so different um, than it has in years past, and we can thank COVID for that. Um, but like you, I'm very grateful and gratified that we have this opportunity, even if virtual, to come together and recognize the contributions of Daniel Bennett, Robert Carroll, John O'Hara, Sue Sargent, and Mary Trotto. These five individuals and many, many others who haven't been nominated yet um, have decades of service to our community, and we hope much, much more to give. We thank them and we thank their families for helping to make our Maui County community stronger and more resilient. And, and to them, a special message. You make us a community of strength, and we are so grateful. Thank you very much, and have an excellent event today. Thank you. Um, many of you may not know that um, there is a, a formal group that is tasked to advise the mayor 
with regard to aging issues, and it is called the Council on Aging. Um, however, I'm realizing in uh, Linda, were you going to speak as well? Sorry, little back up. Uh, that, that's okay. Um, yeah, thank, thank you, Deb. Actually, I just yes. I just wanted to add um, my own warm welcome. Uh, to all of you attending the event today and express my appreciation again to the Office on Aging and the staff, as well as the, um, the nominees for uh, being such a, a vision of strength for our community. It's very clear um, from this list of nominees that uh, even in these challenging times, we have got endurance and strength in our community and not have gotten to where we are without you. So I just wanted to um, thank you all for participating and for being here and um, hope that you have an absolutely wonderful event. Thank you. Thank you, Linda. I had scrolled down a little too far on my production uh, script. So uh, it wouldn't be a live event without a few small fun things to remember, right? So back to the Council on Aging, we do have a formal group that advises the mayor with regard to aging issues, and that's the Council on Aging. I now welcome Doreen Forsberg, the current chair of the Council on Aging, to say a few words. Welcome, Doreen. Thank you, Deborah. Um, Deborah, aloha mai Cole. I'm so happy to be here today, and on behalf of myself and the entire Council on Aging, uh, we are so proud of, to be a part of this event, um, but mahalo to Council on Aging, who is always there for all of us, um, and then the nominees, right? They're all winners in our heart, but I know there can only be two, and like um, Lori stated, right, there's more nominees out there, and they'll slowly come forward, but I just want to um, thank you all for letting us be here, excited to be a part of it. Um, and then my final thought, and that's always in my head, it always takes a village, right? And we rely on our kupuna to help guide us to all the things we want to do for them and for our next generations that are coming in. So can't wait for the celebration to begin. Mahalo, Deborah. Thank you, Doreen. Our next speaker um, undoubtedly needs no real introduction. She has worked diligently for many years to make Maui County a community of strength. Please join me in welcoming the Maui County Council Chair, Alice Lee. Thank you, Deborah. Aloha, everyone. On behalf of all nine council members, I would like to recognize and commend the older Americans of Maui County. A thank you for gener generously giving of your time to make this county of ours a very special place. On this occasion, we acknowledge in particular individuals who have been selected for their high achievements, dedication, and contributions to our community. In East Asia, there is a custom when greeting someone, especially kupuna, you extend your arms forward and gently lift the elbows to show support and respect to the other person. Today, we lift the elbows of Ms. Sargent, Ms. Trotto, former council member Robert Carroll, Mr. Bennett, and Mr. O'Hara. To show our support, our respect, and our immense gratitude for their lifetime of giving of themselves to others. Let's take this time to celebrate and honor our nominees with their families and friends as they receive this special honor on this, the 52nd Annual Outstanding Older American Celebration. Thank you. Thank you, Chair Lee. That was a really beautiful picture. Um, it's, a, it's a very nice image, and I, I think it really characterizes um, how Hawaii, frankly, and Maui County in particular, um, treats kapuna. And we really do want to come alongside and, and support and respect. So thank you for that visual image. We're also pleased today to have with us 
the director of the Hawaii State Executive Office on Aging, Caroline Katirao. Caroline leads the efforts in the, throughout the state of Hawaii to ensure that older people have services and supports they need to live independently with dignity. Caroline? Good morning, Deborah. Good morning, everyone. Can you hear me? Yes. Coming in clear, I hope. <laughs> well, good morning. And on behalf of the Executive Office on Aging, I just want to thank all of the Maui nominees for your dedication to the community service. This day is really about you and to honor you and your contributions to your community. Volunteers play a vital role in our communities, and I just want to thank you for making Maui a better place to live. So mahalo for your dedication, and I look forward to seeing the winners. Thank you. I am now pleased to introduce our entertainment for today, who is Keikoa Ripani. He is a, he's Maui born and raised, he's married and has two children, and happens to be a relative of one of our um, colleagues here at Office on Aging. He's going to sing first, Welcome to My World. Following his first song, we're going to go right into the introductions of our nominees for today, Kevin Dusenberry and Ray Ann Pagatpatan from the Office on Aging will do those introductions. Following those introductions, Keikoa will then sing the song Island Style. We hope you enjoy the next several minutes that will take us to today's big reveal of the 2021 Male and Female Maui County Outstanding Older Americans. So stay tuned right here and Keikoa, take it away. Welcome to my world Hey, won't you come on in Miracles I know Happen time and time again Step inside my heart And leave your cares behind Welcome to my world I'll build with you in mind Knock and the door will open Seek and you will find Ask and you shall be given A key to this world of mine I'll be waiting here With my arms and fur And I'm waiting just for you So welcome to my world Knock and the door will open Seek and you will find Ask and you shall be given A key to this world of mine And I'll be waiting here With my arms and I'm waiting just for you So welcome to my world I'll be waiting just for you So welcome to my world Dan Bennett, 77, of Kauna Kakai, is a well-known member of the Molokai community. He is a founding member of the Molokai Arts Center, a nonprofit organization sponsoring various arts education and activities. 
The owner of Bennett Pottery has taught hundreds of Molokai residents, including Keiki and Kupuna, the art of ceramics. Dan, a former math teacher at Molokai High, was very involved with the students and the community. During his tenure at Molokai High, he supported the basketball team often. Although retired, he is still very engaged with the community marches and is still passionate about current events on the island. For over 20 years, Dan volunteered with the Nature Conservancy Earth Day Committee. He helped with planning the annual Earth Day celebrations, which attracted about 1,000 community members each year. On his free time, Dan enjoys surfing. For over 10 years, Dan has been organizing Keiki Surf Meets. He and other members of the surf community hold the surf meets, judge and score the participants, and award the winners with prizes. To this day, these meets are still very popular among the Molokai youngsters. Shirley Sue Sargent, 83, of Kahana Maui, has been nominated for the tireless and selfless compassion that she has for others. For over 19 years, she has been working at Ark of Maui as a personal assistant. Every Sunday, she assists five adults with special needs at the Napili Group Home. Sue has a personal client she cares for five days a week. She effortlessly incorporates her client with her daily activities, such as running errands, attending meetings, and visiting the coffee shop. Every day, Sue also feeds the feral cats around her neighborhood. Recently, she and her neighbors managed to spay and neuter 35 cats to control the colony's population. As a member and community aide of His Grace Ministries Church in Lahaina, Sue volunteers with various food distributions and community events put on by the church. As a member of their outreach team, she helps fundraise money through bake sales and garage sales. During the holiday season, Sue enjoys partnering with the Salvation Army as a bell ringer. She and her clients get together to entertain shoppers in hopes to raise money and provide holiday cheer outside of Walgreens. As you can see, Sue is busy all week long. She allows herself one day off, which she can enjoy with her husband. Together, they like to meet up with friends, visit different restaurants, hang out at the yacht club, and sometimes venture to upcountry to enjoy the scenery. On her days off, she can be found either at the art gallery or the jewelry store, both of which they own. Although Sue lives a very busy and active life as an older American, she enjoys helping others and being able to make a positive impact in all of their lives. Robert Bob Carroll, 77 of Hana Maui, is being nominated for the time, talent, and wisdom he has contributed to his community across Maui County and through the state of Hawaii. In his hometown in East Maui, Bob has been committed to representing the needs of fellow Hana residents and preserving the history of the beloved town. For over 40 years, Bob has been a consultant volunteer of HANA Community Consultant. He has also served as board president for the HANA Maui Trust Board for almost 30 years. On a larger scale, Bob has been a board chair of the Maui Community Workday and a member for the Safe Communities of Maui County. He continues to sit on the Maui Adult Daycare Center Board of Directors which helps make decisions regarding kupuna at the various daycare centers. As a person with disability himself, Bob is passionate of advocating for others with disabilities. From 2005 to 2013, Bob also served on the Juvenile Justice State Advisory Council. For eight years, Bob played an integral role ensuring fair treatment for challenged youth and for advocating support to programs that aid the juvenile justice system. Bob's most well-known achievement was serving on the Maui County Council, appointed to represent East Maui. During his term, some of his accomplishments included an affordable housing project in Hana and restoring the Waikamoe flume, which now allows a resource of water for both residential and agricultural use. Although retired, Bob continues to work tirelessly alongside his Hana residents and represents the voice of the community. On his free time, Bob enjoys fishing, gardening, and spending time with his family. 
Dr. Mary Trotto, 73, of Kihei, Maui, is a very influential icon in South Kihei. She has been nominated for her incredible energy and her dedication to help others in her community. For over 20 years, she has been an integral leader for Hale Kau Kau at St. Teresa Church. Every month, she puts in at least 180 hours volunteering to help feed over 150 individuals per night, 365 days a year. They also prepare and deliver meals to 80 homebound individuals nightly. For over 10 years, Mary has been volunteering with the organization South Maui Volunteers, an organization that focuses on building fencing and ramps at beaches, as well as dune restoration. Also in South Kihei, Mary puts in time tracking homeless issues for the Kihei Community Association and monitoring the safety of Kalama Park with Kalama Park Action Team. In the last two years, Mary has been working with Hawaii Hazards Awareness and Resilience Program, collaborating with state officials to create a plan for South Maui in case of an emergency. In fact, she has been recently appointed by Council Member Kelly King to study homeless and houseless issues in the County of Maui as part of the County of Maui's Commission on Healing Solutions for Homelessness. On her free time, Mary enjoys traveling, canoe paddling, running, and all other track and field events. She has been an active member for the United States of America Track and Field Association, where she was presented Masters Track and Field Athlete of the Year in 2013. Because running has been a passion of Mary's, she has participated in various races to support nonprofit organizations. These races varied from 5Ks to marathons, including the New York City Marathon at the age of 63 and this year's virtual race at age 73. For several years, Mary put together the Stomp Out Hunger campaign to raise money for Holly Cow Cow. This year, the organization is celebrating their 30th year anniversary with a virtual fundraiser called Season of Hope. John O'Hara, 71 of Hana, Maui, is nominated for his dedication and volunteerism in preserving the beauty of East Maui. For three years, John has served as vice chairman of Ke Awo Hali'i, a committee created to protect the Hana coast. Through his past efforts, the organization received funding for eight paid positions. He has testified at various county hearings, which has successfully granted Ke Awo Hali'i several parcels of land. As a result, John and other volunteers used this land to identify and address historic and cultural concerns for heiaus, promote environmental incentives for endangered wildlife, and provide educational opportunities for watershed management and edible plant food sources. John is also involved with an organization committed to protecting the EV at Hamoa. In the past, EV or ancestral bones were removed and taken to an off-site location. However, as a part of Mr. O'Hara and the group's effort, the EV were returned to its rightful burial grounds at Hamoa. Mr. O'Hara then influenced hotel management to educate visitors of the sacred nature of the area. Recently, John has joined the Kupuna of Hana Council where he and other kupuna meet and discuss various current events and possible issues in the HANA community. Through John's various involvement in the community, future generations will be able to enjoy the HANA coast as it was and as it should be for many years to come. When he is not busy volunteering at the various East Maui organizations mentioned, John enjoys golfing, cleaning yard, and fixing lawnmowers and his classic truck. Mama's in the kitchen cooking in a real nice Peace to on the stove, let me send me with that We then drink and we sing all day Kani kapila in the old Hawaiian way on the island we do it our in style From the mountain to the ocean From the windward to the leeward side 
on the island We do it our in style From the mountain to the ocean From the river to the leeward side Go grandma's house on the weekend clean up if we no go, grandma gotta work hard You know my grandma, she like a boy real sour My love, my grandma, every minute, every hour on the island We do it island style From the mountain to the ocean, from the river to the leeward side On the island we do it all in style From the mountain to the ocean From the river to the leeward side Mama's in the kitchen cooking dinner real nice Beef stew on the stove, loamy salmon with the ice We then drink and we sing all day Cani capila in the old Hawaiian way on the island We do it island style From the mountain to the ocean, from the windbird to the leeward side On the island, we do it island style from the mountain to the ocean, from the river to leeward side. From the mountain to the ocean, from the river to leeward side. From the mountain to the ocean, from the river to the leeward side. Thank you, Kei Koa, very much. And now I believe we have worked out the technical difficulties, at least with Sen Senator Baker. Senator. Aloha. It's an honor and a privilege to join you this morning to recognize Maui's Outstanding Older Americans for 2021. Although I've known most of our honorees for many years, I learned something new and special about each one after I had the opportunity to read their bios. For our honorees, your, ears, your years of helping others has earned you much admiration and respect. So on behalf of my House and Senate colleagues in the legislature, it's my great honor and privilege to present each of you with a congratulatory certificate celebrating your accomplishments and commemorating your special recognition. Maui County is so fortunate to have each of you as distinguished and outstanding residents. Mahalo nui loa. Thank you, Senator Baker. And now, like the island style song lyrics say, from the mountains to the oceans, from the windward to the leeward, we have members of the Office on Aging staff on site. <laughs> um, and um, we're going to actually, I don't, first of all, we're going to be going to James Mariano and Vicki Bellamini. So if you guys can unmute, um, they are about to help us uh, yes. announce the female Outstanding Older American of Maui County for 2021. They're going to knock on the door. Oh. Whose door are they at? Mary, is that you, Mary? Hi, Mary. I'm looking at the TV. Oh, no. And we have all kinds of fun things for you. Oh, Congratulations. Like Congratulations, Mary. You're the 2021 oh, you. Outstanding thank Woman you. of the Year from Maui County. And as I said, this is my birthday weekend. 
on Sunday. Oh, that's perfect! <laughs> Congratulations! Thank you. Thank you. Let's, oh my let's, God. Where would you like us to put all of this oh, stuff? Yeah, yeah. We've got a gift basket here for you. My family, my sister, and my brother-in-law. Thank you. Thank you so much. Oh yeah. my God, I'm so shocked. And we have an honor. This so is a gift for you. That in addition to a gift basket, thank you so much. There is a. There's also a wonderful plaque here for me, my dear. Oh, thank you. Thank you. I'll put it over here. Thank you so much. Yes. Wow. Unbelievable. <laughs> yes. Well, you have done very amazing. You certainly deserve it. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you for honoring all the people. They were doing thanks, so wonderful things. Yeah, and thanks to Adele yeah. for nominating us. Yes, and yes. Adele. We yes. all are right now. I was so well, hopefully she's watching. Yes, yes. She no, I said to Adele, what are you nominating me for? I should be nominating you for all the things she does. She already know. won. I know. <laughs> but she still does fabulous things. That's a real good thing. Okay, well, back to okay. you, Dad. Well, thank you. On the scene, they were. And just so folks know, um, there was a gift basket with some goodies. There is a beautiful commemorative koa clock. Um, and then each of our individuals um, who spoke today and were with us presented um, certificates um, for the winners and the nominees. So... Nominees, you'll be receiving um, some gift bas baskets and certificates in the mail from us, or they might be hand-delivered later today. So thank you so much for that. Mary Trotto, congratulations, uh, Maui County. Whoops. Maui, and I turned my phone off before this. Maui County, Outstanding Older American Female for 2021. Thank you so much, and congratulations. All right, and now we're going to switch to our second group of on-the-spot reporters, Claudette Medeiros and Sharon Nobriga. Take it away, ladies. Unmute yourselves. Uh-oh, they froze. Oh. They froze. Oh. Well, they're frozen, so you guys might want to turn your camera off while you're walking up to the door. Can you? We tested this. Believe it or not, we tested all of the um, connections. I will tell you they're in a spot that if the clouds aren't just right, however, the connection can get uh, interrupted. Sharon and Claudette, are you guys there? Wow. wow. We can hear you. We can hear you. Ah. Ah. Oh. oh. Well. No. Well, we can let them, maybe you guys should just go ahead and go knock on the door. We, oh, here, right now. Okay. okay, you guys see us? Yes, now we can. Yes, now we can. Okay, hold on. But you muted yourself. But you muted yourself. Oh. Okay. Congratulations. Oh. Congratulations. So what's this? Oh. oh my goodness. I am really surprised. Oh, well, I'm so glad you are surprised. <laughs> I'm watching TV. I'm so, I hope you guys are watching the Aqua Twitch. We're watching and oh. she ran off. Oh. Congratulations. So Sharon and Claudette are in the home of Mr. Robert Carroll. 
He is being recognized Please, today. Yeah. 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 I can grab it from this side. The cloth. Oh, my God. It's in here. It's very oh. beautiful. Thank you so much. Oh, well, well deserved. Having in this weather. Oh, my God. The drive was just so beautiful. <laughs> Everybody knows Hannah is beautiful. They do. And um, we're hoping for sun. But that's okay. It's oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, we're it's a special, special, you. Special, special, yes, a special day for you. Oh, oh my goodness. You. <laughs> well, I'd like to think about a special day for all the older Americans. It is. It is. Yeah. It is. That, yeah. uh, there's so many that never get any recognition. Yeah. And I would hope that they all see this and know that actually this award is really representing all the ones that are out there. Yes, beautiful. And I really yeah. appreciate it. Yes, we Thank do you. have many, many volunteers that need to be recognized. Right. And you're yes. one of them. <laughs> Thank you. Thank we you. Thank you all. for all the work yes. you've done. Right. Thank you. Thank and you. the support of your family. Can't forget that. <laughs> Do you need a fish? <laughs> Beautiful. Look at the fish tank. Yeah. Yes, we were watching yes. TV and we just said, well, I know I didn't win anything because it never come all the way out here. <laughs> oh. oh, no. No fly. <laughs> Thank you so much. Congratulations, you so much. To Congratulations Mary Trotto and Robert Carroll. And again, to all of our nominees, you are all uniquely special. And your contributions make Maui County better each and every day. So we are so grateful. We are enriched by all that you do to make life better. Um, thank you for the example that you set for all of us. We'll do our best to follow in your footsteps to keep Maui a community of strength. And thank you to everyone who's joined us today. We appreciate, you know, making it with us through the ups and the downs and the production um, issues, but what's mostly important is all of our kapuna, and we hope that's what you leave today with, that our hearts are full because of you, because of all you do, because of who you are, the wisdom that you carry. We need you. Until next year, everyone stay safe, stay strong, stay engaged. We now welcome Keikoa to close to today's event by leading us in the singing of Hawaii Aloha. Mahalo Keikoa. Following Keikoa, we will be running, um, if you missed at the beginning, the um, slideshow of all of Maui County's past Older Americans winners. So thank you again. Mahalo, take care. Aloha. E Hawaii e kuone hanaui Kuu hone kula i vine Oli no au i na pono Oh, uh -huh.
aloha, aloha, Hawaii. E hau o li e na o pio o Hawaii nei. Aloha, Aloha, Hawaii. 